We're doing EMOM style uh, workout today, uh, hit format. So it will be fast. Uh, 40 seconds on, 20 seconds rest each exercise. There are three sets. We're doing um, legs, uh, upper body, core, and then we always finish our hit workouts with uh, uh, ab circuit in the end. So there'll be six exercises for abs of one minute each. Uh, if time permits, we'll also do a plank hold. Uh, it's a nice way to finish off. And then we do a, a stretching and a cool down. So um, I've also included uh, every time in a in a hit format. I include some a technique about boxing. So slowly uh, over the three weeks, we learn different boxing techniques, and I make it part of the hit session, which is not normally uh, there in any hit session. If you, you know, if you've done a hit session outside, so it's uh, a fusion of say some boxing plus also abs. That's why uh, these sessions are slightly more unique than a normal hit session. We still do full body. Okay, let's start. Let's get on uh, in position. I think people might still join later. <coughs> also, each ex each uh, hit format we start with a full body uh, warm up. So let's start with a warm up first. Roll your heads all the way back and then forward. Go back and forward. And three. Go back. Forward, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Okay, move your head sideways, both sides left and right. One, and two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, and ten. Move your head all the way around. So full rotations. One, slowly. Go all the way back and forward. Two, all the way around. Three, four, and five. Okay, opposite direction, head rotations. Go all the way around again. Five, and four, and three, and two and one okay shoulder rotations so get both your hands on your shoulders and go in and then out all the way one two three four five six seven eight nine and ten opposite direction so inside and out again one two three four five six seven eight nine and ten okay both feet together and stretch out and go high on your toes so one and two three and four five and six seven change your hand position so eight one direction and then the other direction one hand up one hand down then right hand up, left hand down. So both hands go. Last 10, nine, eight, and seven, six, and five. Finish it, four, and three, two, and one. Okay. Let's do our uh, hip rotations. So let's move the hips around. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Opposite direction, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one sideways stretches so get your feet outside your shoulders and then we go sideways down one two three four stretch down five let's go six seven eight nine ten 
10 more, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Nice one. Let's do our uh, sideways rotation. So move your body all the way around. Go back, look at the center of the ceiling, and then move around again. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and finish. Okay, few more exercises. Your right hand goes to your left toe and then your left hand goes to your right toe so move across don't do this when you go down you're looking up to the ceiling and then switch again you're going down looking up to the ceiling let's go three two one go one two three four five six seven look up eight when you're down nine ten ten nine eight seven six five four three two and one nice one okay so for the legs swings both legs together and we're going to swing the right leg forward and all the way back so forward and then all the way back how much ever you can go as high as possible three two one go on. one two three four Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Nice one. Okay. Same leg, we go side extension. So, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Left leg. The both feet together and then the left leg goes forward and all the way back. Let's go. One, two, three. Balance yourself. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Okay. So left leg side extensions. Let's go. Ten, nine, up, eight, seven, six, five, Four, three, two, and one. Last couple of exercises, ankle rotations. So take your right leg out and rotate your ankles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Opposite direction, same ankle. Ten, nine, eight, seven. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Left leg out, ankle rotations. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Opposite direction, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Okay. We're doing two exercises to finish up, uh, to finish up our uh, warm up. It's more to get your heart rate going. So the first one is jumping jacks. You're going to do 40 jumping jacks. We're going to start slow and then we're going to build up the intensity. So the first one is jumping jacks, full extension and out. Full extension out. Remember when you jump, do a soft landing on your knees. Don't don't do a hard landing. Okay, take care of your knees. So ready? Go in three, two, one. Let's go. One, two. Slow it down. Three, four. Full stretch, full extension. Seven, eight, nine, ten, ten, nine, eight, seven, six. On my count. Go fast for the next 20 in three, two, one, and go. One, two, three, four, five, six, 
seven, eight, nine, ten. Last ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Okay. The second exercise to finish up our warm up round is break dancers. So get those uh, dancing shoes out that you usually do it in a club, but you can't right now, so we do it at home. Okay, you get on all your fours, take your knees up, and then your left hand goes up and your right leg goes forward. Come back in the same position, opposite side. So it goes one and one. We're doing 10 on each side. Okay, ready? Get on your knees, or then take your knees off the ground. Okay, now let's go on one. One and one, two and two. Your leg comes forward, three and three. Yeah, go forward and back, five and five. Your other hand goes up, okay, six and six. Seven and seven. Take your hand up. So left leg up, right leg in the forward, and left leg forward, right leg up. Right hand up. One and one. Last three, three and three and two and two and one and one. Okay. We start with the EMOM. The first three exercises, we're doing the legs first. First three exercises, just watch me and then we start. Okay, so jump squats with pulses. Jump squats, get in squat position. Your legs are in line with your shoulders. Your toes are pointed out at 45. This is a squat, just a normal squat. Hips out and knees out. Okay, jump squats, and when you come up, we jump and then come down. Jump and we come down. Okay. Again, soft landing. Keep your knees soft. No noise on the floor. So when you're coming down, you want to make no noise on the floor. You're not waking up your neighbors. People stay under your house this early morning. Okay. What we do is the last 10 seconds on my count, when we finish the jump squats, you stay down and you do pulses. 10, 9, 8. Okay. So we'll finish off jump squats with pulses. The second one is reverse lunge into a high knee. So we we'll start with the right leg, right leg down, reverse lunge. Your body is at 90 degrees. Then you come up. When you come up, you go into a high knee. Into a high knee. Reverse lunge, high knee. Reverse lunge, high knee. The third one is squat hold with side steps. Squat hold is with side step. Stay down in squat hold and then leg out and back. Leg out and back. No bouncing. You don't want to do this and this. What you're doing is staying in squat hold out and out. Out and out. Okay. Each exercise you're going to do twice. Three exercises. Uh, the uh, three exercises. The whole set is for two times. Okay. 40 seconds on and 20 seconds rest. Starting with jump squats, then reverse lunges, and then squat hold. All right. I'm getting the timer. Those who have a smartwatch, a sports watch, put your uh, watch into a high intensity mode so you can count your calories at the end of this session. I will send out some stats, stats anyways. Okay. Starting in 20 seconds, get in position for jump squats. In 10 seconds, no stopping for 40 seconds. You can slow it down, but don't stop. In three, two, one, let's go. Jump squats, up and down. One, two, keep going, keep going. 
keep going. Let's go. Nice one, Pratap. Rohan, no stopping. Up, up. Go down more. Him, go down more. Try to, when you come up, come into a jump and then go down him. If you can. Let's do those jumps. In three, two, one. Stay down and do the pulses. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and up. Nice one. Reverse lunge into high knees, starting in 10 seconds. We go with the right leg first. In 3, 2, 1, go. Leg goes back and up. Back and up, back and up, back and up, back and go as high as possible and down and up, down and up, down. 20 seconds to go, halfway there already. Let's finish this. Last 10 seconds to go. Up, finish it Pratap, go slow but try and finish it. Keep balance in three, two, one, and rest for 20 seconds. Third exercise, we're doing the squat hold with the side step. First, go into a nice squat hold on my count, and then move sideways out and out. Okay? In three, two, one, and down, everyone, in squat hold, and move. One, and one, two, and two, three, and three, four, and four. Let's go, five, and five, six. Rowan, go down a bit more. Aim slightly lower in squat hold. Nice one, Amy. 15 seconds to go, only 15. Finish this set, then we have one more round only. Rowan, stay down and move. Keep going, last five, four, three, two, one, and rest for 20 seconds. Back to the first exercise. Don't have a sip of water just now, you'll have a minute's break before the next round, so you can have it then. Jump squats with pulses, starting. Three, two, one, let's go. Down and up, down and up. Down and up, down and up. Soft landing on your knees. Keep it very, very soft. Up and down. 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 Let's go. Halfway there, more than halfway there. Let's finish it. In three, two, one. Stay down and pulses. 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. 20 seconds rest. Okay, legs are nicely fired up. Left leg coming up in five seconds. Three, two, one, go back and up, back and up. Let's go back and up. 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 Let's go. 20 seconds in. 10, 20 to go. Halfway there. Let's go. Let's finish it. And up. Down and up. Down. Last five seconds, guys. Finish it slow and steady. Three, two, one, and rest. For 20. Last exercise of this round for your legs. Squat and side steps. Not bad. Ooh, Monday morning. Let's get it going. Three, two, one, and go down in squat hold. Then move, one, and one, two, and two, 
three, and three. Stay down, Ron. Balance. Nice one, Pratap. Nice one, Haim. Keep going, Amy. Good form. 15 seconds to go to finish legs. Nice and easy. Let's do this. Breathe out when you go out, always. Come on. Last three, two, one, and rest. Okay, have a sip of water. And watch me so you know the next round. One minute break, or watch me. We're doing upper body now. Three exercises. Push up, hold, and then push ups. What is that? So, go down in push up position and then stay down. You're not going to lie down fully, just off the floor. Your back is straight, your body's parallel to the floor. So, stay down in push up position. Last 10 seconds, we're doing push ups. Remember, hands in line with shoulders and elbows in. When you go, for push-ups, don't stick your elbows out. Get them in towards you, towards your chest. The second one is push-up position rows or renegade rows. So get in push-up position. Those who can't be in push-up position, put your knees down and then do this. So hands next to your chest and the back. Next to your chest and back. No moving of the body. No body movements. Just your hands move slowly next to your chest and down. Next to your chest and down. So we don't want to move your core or your upper body when you're moving your hands. Okay. The third one is a boxing round, which I'll show you just now. So watch the technique. We're going to get in boxing stance, which is left leg, leg forward, pointed straight ahead and right leg at 45, okay? Then we start with your elbows in, hands up, and you move in a pendulum position back and forward, back and forward, back and forward. This is a normal back boxing position. When I say punch, then this is left straight, right straight. So left is forward, just normal punch, coming from your shoulders, not Taking your arm behind. So it comes straight from your shoulder, just here, left. Right punch, you have to move your right leg. So right is like this and back. You're taking power from your side, extension coming and coming back in boxing and go back into a pendulum position. Okay? So when I say punch, left straight, right straight. Left straight, right straight. We're adding a slight variation. So defense and attack. When I say get into boxing position, we're always moving forward, back, forward, back, forward, back. Elbows up. And then when I say punch, left straight, right straight. Then we go into defense, swing back. Only move from your waist. Take support from your back leg. Slight swing back. So don't go like this, okay? Just slight swing back. When you come back, come back with your right. Right punch first, and then left punch. So, left straight, right straight, swing back, right, left. And back to pendulum. Always keep moving those legs back and forward. When I say punch, stop, left straight, right straight, swing back, right, left. When you swing back and come, you're getting power when you're coming back from your swing, straight into your right. Always twist your leg for the right. Okay, so three exercises. One, the last one is the boxing technique. The first one is push up, hold for 30 seconds and then last 10 seconds push up. Ready? In three, two, one. Let's go down and push up and hold. Push up and hold for 30 seconds. Go down and stay down. Stay down. Almost 20 seconds in, in last 10 on my count, go for push-ups, normal push-ups. Elbows tucked in, those who can't be in full push-up position, put your knees down and do the 
normal push-ups. Three, two, one. Let's go for push-ups. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Nice one. Next one. We're staying down in push-up position and doing the rows, renegade rows. No moving your upper body. Again, those who can't be in push-up position can put your knees down. In three, two, one. Let's go. Push and pull. Pull. Let's get that hand next to your chest up and down. Up and down. Slow it down. No moving your upper body. No moving your hips. Try to keep your hips more in position, Pratap. Don't move your hips. Nice one, Rohan Sona. Nice one, Hames. Try to slow your hand movements down as much as possible, Him. Get more impact on your core. Let's go. And your back. Squeeze that back. Take your hand all the way up. In three, two, one, and on your feet. Okay. Everyone on their feet. Let's start moving in pendulum position for the boxing round coming up. Forward, back, forward, back. Hands up, elbows in. Start moving forward and back. Slow and then fast. Slow movements are this, and then fast is like this. When I say punch, left straight. So when I say punch, stop the pendulum movement, left straight, right straight. Swing back, right, and then left. In three, two, one. Let's go punch. One, two, swing back, one, two. And pendulum again. Elbows in, even when you're punching, elbows in. Okay. And punch. One, two, swing back, punch, punch. And move again. Let's keep moving those legs forward and back, forward and back. Hands up, elbows in, punch. One, two, swing back, one, two. And punch. One, two, swing back, one, two. And punch. One, two, swing back, one, two. Keep moving those legs. Okay, stop, punch. One, two, swing back, one, two. Last 10 seconds, punch. One, two, swing back, one, two. Keep moving those legs. Even if it's slow, it's fine, Pratap. Keep moving your legs forward and back. Forward and back, forward, back, forward, back. Small movements, small. I'm just showing you an exaggerated one to get. Last punch and punch. One, two, swing back, punch, punch. Okay, 20 seconds rest. And back to the first one, which is push up, hold, and then push ups. So get on your mat, starting in five, four, three, two, one, and down, hold it. Elbows in. Start smelling that floor, but don't go bang on the floor. Just off the floor, keep your body parallel for oh, 30 seconds. The last 10 seconds is push ups. 20 seconds in, in 10 seconds, we go for push ups. In five, four, three, two, one, and go up and down, up and down, up and down, up. And down, slow it down, up and down. Elbows in, up and down, and relax for 20 seconds. We're going for the renegade rows. You'll stay on your mat and let's get the upper back worked out. In three, in two, in one, and let's go up and up, up and up, up and up. Up and up. Let's keep going up and up. 20 seconds in, 20 to go only. Don't move that upper body. This is the last one. Keep your core tight. So now move your hands slower. Slower. Nice one, Pratap. Squeeze that back when you get your arms up. In three, two, one, and on your feet. On your feet, as soon as you get up,
start moving back and forth, back and forward, back and forward. Hands up, elbows in, elbows in. Cover your face and your body, but watch your opponent. And let's go punch. Left, right, swing back, right, left. And punch, 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 back, punch, punch. Okay, forward, back, punch. One, two, swing back, punch, punch. And back. Punch, one, two, swing back, punch, punch. And go. One, two, swing back, punch, punch. And punch, one, two, swing back, punch, punch. And go. One, two, swing back, punch, punch. Last 10 seconds. Punch. One, two, swing back, punch, punch. And go. Punch, punch, swing back, punch, punch. Punch. One, two, swing back, punch, punch. Last one. Punch. One, two, swing back, punch, punch. Okay, round two is done. Have a sip of water. Not too much. Don't sit down completely. Keep your body warmed up. Walk around as if you're walking in a park. Chill out. Okay. We're doing a core, three exercises for the core, which leads us nice, nicely into the ab circuit after this. So the first one is we get into push-up position or a high plank position. We move three steps on one side. One, two, three. And then we do four mountain climbers. One, two, three, four. Move again. One, two, three. One, two, three, and four mountain climbers. Four sets of mountain climbers. So four on each leg. One, two, three, and then one, two, three, four. Okay. Those who can't basically be able to move, do a normal mountain climbers only. Stay in position and do a no normal mountain climbers. If you have a slightly lesser strength on your upper body, which you can build over time, but for now you can just stay in push-up position and do the mountain climbers. Okay, the next one is a plank hold. Simply a plank hold for 40 seconds. Plank hold is your feet almost in line with the shoulder slightly inside. Your body is your back is parallel to the floor, your body is parallel to the floor, and your arms are also parallel to each other, and just look straight ahead. Stay there for 40 seconds. The third one is a side plank hold with the star position. So, this is as if you're chilling on the beach, only that you're not, because your hips are off the floor, and this is side plank. Those who can, take your leg up and your hand up. Okay, so this is a star side plank. If you can't take your hand and leg up or if you need some support, put your hand down. Just now my right hand is down, taking support as a right hand side plank. My left hand, I'm taking support and keeping my leg up and my hips off the floor. So we do a side plank hold or a star side plank hold or a semi side plank hold, star side plank hold. Okay, one side and then we do the other side in the next round. So three simple exercises. First one, is a high plank, side to side, three steps and mountain climbers. The second one is a plank hold and the third one is a side plank hold. Let's get ready. So get onto your mat. I'm gonna get you slightly closer on my camera so I can watch you. All right, let's go sideways, three steps and then mountain climbers. Those who can't move sideways, stay in, Normal push-up position and just do the mountain climbers at a steady pace for 40 seconds. Starting in three, two, one. Let's go. Move sideways. One, two, three. Then mountain climbers. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. And one, two, three, four. Let's move sideways. One, two, three. And mountain climbers. One, two. Three, four, move sideways. One, two, three, and go. One, two, three, four. Let's move sideways. One, two, three, and mountain climbers. One, two, three, four. Let's move last one. One, 
two, three, and one, two, three, four. Nice, one. 20 seconds break, and we're going into a simple plank hold. All right. 10 seconds and a plank hold. Ready? In five, four, three, two, one, and up everyone, for 40 seconds. Let's do a simple plank. Put up hips slightly lower, lower, yeah. Legs out a bit more, don't bend your knees. Knees straight. Nice, one, stay there, in plank hold, for only 40 seconds. We are 20 seconds in. Only 15 to go now. Stay there for last 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, five, four, four, three, three, two, two, and one. Okay. We're going a side plank hold on the right hand side in this round. So lie down as if you're on the beach. In five seconds, you're not going to be on the beach. Three, two, one, and up. And hand up if you can, and a leg up also if you can. If you need support, put one hand down and keep your leg up. At all times, hips off the floor. Hips off the floor. That's the main goal. Stay there. Take support if you need with your other hand. 15 seconds in, 25 to go. Let's do this slowly. Five seconds break, Pratap. Three, two, one, and up again. Up, up, up again. Stay there, inside plank. For last 10, eight, six, four, four, three, three, two, two, and one. Okay. Okay, back to the first one, which is sidestep mountain climbers. Coming up, in, 10 seconds. Okay, ready? In position, in five, four, three, two, one, and move sideways, one, two, three, and mountain climbers, one, two, three, four, Sonal hips lower, one, two, three, one, two, three, four. Move sideways, one, two, three, and one, two, three, four. Move sideways, one, two, three, and go. One, two, three, and four. Last 15, go. Sideways and mountain climbers, one, two, three, four. Move sideways, one, two, three, and mountain climbers, one, two, last one, move sideways, one, two, three, and one, two, three, four, and 20 seconds rest. Okay, everyone, keep smiling, it's only Monday morning. The week's just started. Going in to a nice plank hold in three, Two, one, and up everyone. Up for 40 seconds. Hands parallel to each other. Back is absolutely straight. Body is absolutely parallel to the floor. Pratap, up in five, four, three, two, one, and go. Up. Nice one. You can take a five seconds break and come back. And come back. Let's build that ability to do a longer plank hold slowly over this three weeks. Last 10 seconds to go. Stay there. Five, five, four, four, three, three, only two, two, and one. Relax. For 20 seconds only. Left side, side plank hold, coming up in 10, in eight. So left hand down, right hand goes up, and left 
right leg also goes up. If you want, put your right hand down. Three, two, one. Let's go up and up. Everyone, for 40 seconds, this is the last side plank hold. Let's go. Let's finish it. Halfway there. Just 20 more seconds. Am I cheating? Maybe just slightly. Maybe the cheating is allowed for five extra seconds. Okay. For Pratap, everyone, five, four, three, two, one, and up. For 10 seconds only. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Relax. Okay. E mom style is over, but guess what? The best part is the abs for one minute each exercise. Only six exercises have only a small sip of water. I'll show you two exercises at a time. So the first one is shin hugs. And the second one is plank to push up. So shin hugs all the way behind. Going to come up, legs in and hug your shins, go back. Up and back, up and back, up and back. Okay, so that's a shin hug. The second one is a plank hold to push up. So we did a plank hold, we did a push up hold. Now we do plank to push up, push up to plank. Down, down, up, up. Down, down, up, up. Use alternate hands. So the first time going down, right hand down, left hand down, right hand up, left hand up. Then left hand down, right hand down, left hand up, right hand up. So both hands get worked out easily and no moving the upper body or hips. Okay, no funny movements. So two exercises for one minute each. Shin hugs, plank to push up. Let's see how many we can do in a minute. Then we take a break and then the next two. Then we take a break, the next. Then we take a break, no, let's start. Okay, shin hugs, starting. Up, in 10 seconds. So come up and down, okay? In 10 seconds, exactly, for one minute, starting. In three, two, one, and go up and down. Up and down. Let's go up and down. Up, then down. Go slow if you need to, but last for that one minute only. It's only one round, so make the most of it. You can go fully down, lie back down fully, and then get your shins closer, and then come up. And go down, and up. Go down, and up. Go down, and up. Let's go all days. Oh, ab circuit at the end of each exercise to maximize this benefit. Your heart rate should be quite good right now. Up, so maximize. Let's crunch those abs. Let's do that. Last 10 seconds. Slow and steady. Slow and steady. Let's go down and up. Last three, two, one, and stop. Nice one. Nice stamina. Almost everyone. Okay, 20 seconds rest, and then plank to push up. Now starting in 10 for one minute. So easy, steady, don't go too fast. Slow it down, last for the minute. In three, okay, in five, four, three, two, one, and go. Down, down, up, up. Let's go up, up, down, down. Up, up, down, down, up, up, down, down, up, up, down, down. Alternate hands to go down and up. So you get both hands, both arms worked up. Stay in plank to push up for another 30 seconds only. Try not moving your upper body, your hips. They stay steady. Only going up and down. Keep your core tight. Let's go. Five, four, three, 
two, one, and let's go, Pratap. Down, down, up, up. Down, down, up, up. Last 10 seconds, and then we're not doing any more of this. Let's go. Down, down, up, up. Down, down, up, up. Down, down, up, up. Three, two, one, and rest. And watch the next two. For one minute only, six exercises, two are done, four to go. Side heel touches. And bicycle crunches on my count. So side heel touches. Your legs will go at the edge of your mat. So they're slightly outside your shoulders. And if you want to go a bit more advanced, take one step forward. Don't be at 90 degrees or 75. Be at 45 if you can. Your feet are slightly ahead. Now, your chest, your head up, chest off the floor, and then catch one point on the ceiling. Stay there up, and then move sideways. Touch your heel on one side. Move to the other side. Touch your heel on the other side. So, you are doing those side heel touches nice and easy. Try and touch that heel on each side, okay? If you find it very difficult, get your feet slightly closer. Your heels are closer, but you're still getting that sideways movement. More advanced, one step, small step forward, and then reach more, reach more on each side, okay? The second one is bicycle crunches. Let's go cycling in crunch format, okay? So we go one, two, three, four. When I say hold, you stay up and you hold on my count, and then you go again, one, two, three, four. Otherwise, you hold again. You're gonna hold on both sides for at least 10 seconds. All right, ready. First one, side heel touches. This is easy Just for one minute, starting in three, two, one. Let's go, side heel, touch, touch. Hold that one point on the ceiling, Look at that, head up, chest up, and move sideways. If you're finding it easy, your feet are too close. Move them forward, and then touch your heels. Try to touch your heels, make it work for you. Go forward, put those legs slightly ahead, and try to touch them sideways. Head up, chest up, looking up, not at the screen. Look up, straight up, one point on the ceiling. We are almost halfway there now, 30 seconds to go. Keep going, side heel touches. Don't go for speed, slow it down, but make it last for a minute. Only one minute, 20 seconds to go. Not even 20, come on, let's go. 20 seconds to go now, now. So stay up and move sideways. Last 10, nine, eight, seven, six, Five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Backs on the mat, coming up in 20 seconds, is those bicycle crunches. So both your arms under your head, your hands under your head, in three, two, one, let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, and hold up. Hold it up, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, side crunch, three, two, one, and go again, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and hold again on the other side. Hold it for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and last 10, last 10 only, let's go. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, relax. Okay, nice one. What have we got? Only one exercise, the last one, is full crunches with punches. So, normal crunches, you come up and then you stay there and you punch straight forward. One, two, three, four, go down again. Come up. 
one, two, three, four. You can mix it up. So when you come up, you can go one, two, three, four, and down. One, two, three, four, or one, two, three, four, and then down. For one minute only. Those who have a lower back issue, you can lock your feet and take support from a sofa or any support you can find. So put your feet underneath and lock it, and then take support to come up, okay? Those who can do it without support, even better. Don't strain your back. Ready? For one minute only. Last exercise. Let's go. Ready? Three, two, one, and up. One, two, three, four, down. And up. One, two, three, four, and down. Up. One, two, three, four. Stay up. The idea is those punches, making you stay up in crunch for format, and then go down. One, two, three, four, down. And up. One, two, three, four, and down. Up. One, two, three, four. Let's go. 20 seconds in, 40 to go is the last abs exercise. Three, four, down and up. Go slow, take a break of five seconds and back again. Let's go, Pratap. Let's go up. One, two, three, four. Up again. And one, two, three, four. And up again. One, two, three, four. Down and up again. One, two, three, four. And up again. Last 10 seconds to go. Let's go. Down and up. One, two, three, four. Last five. Let's go. One, two, three, four. And up. One, two, three, four. Down. Last one. One, two, three, four. Okay. Have a small sip of water. Wipe that sweat off. And come back for a nice stretch and cool down. It's good timing. We have like approximately 10 but it's left for a nice cool down and stretch. You can take your shoes off now for a nice comfortable stretch. Okay, everyone, feet together in almost like a namaste position with your feet. And then do the small butterflies up and down, up and down. Stretch those hams. Keep your back straight for now. Five, four, three, two, one. And now try and put your knees down more, stretch your hams more, either in this format or you can go down as well. Try to go down as much as you can. Those who do some yoga, we have a yoga session tomorrow evening, 6.30 p.m. IST. That will help you with your stretching and your mobility. So try to make it for that one also. Five, four, three, two, one, and up. Okay. Left leg out, right leg to your thigh, in a thigh. Both your hands up and then try to touch your toes and then try to touch your head to your knee. Let's go. Go down, stretch, breathe out, deep exhales out and stretch more, and stretch more, and stretch more, stretch more. Okay, change, right leg out, left leg to your thigh, both hands up and then to your toes. And stretch, and stretch and stretch and stretch and stretch okay both feet together both your hands up and then down all the way and breathe out and breathe out try to touch your head again to your knees go down as much as you can stay down around this will help your lower back so do as much as you can and come back. Okay, get on all your fours. Do a small shoulder stretch. So your right hand between your leg and your knee stretched out and your head on the mat. Stretch it out as much as you can. And stretch out. And stretch out. And stretch out. 
and up again. Let's go the other side. Left hand between the right hand and your knees. Let's stretch it out. And stretch out. Stretch out. Go as much as you can. Okay. And back again. So get into a push-up position. Don't worry, we're not doing more push-ups. So hands in line with your shoulders. Get push-up position. Your right leg outside your right hand. Right leg outside your right hand, everyone. And both your elbows on the floor. Both elbows down on the floor. Your left leg is off the floor. Your knee is off the floor. Try to push your elbows down as much as you can. Look straight ahead. And switch. Back to push-up position. Your left leg outside your left hand. And then both your elbows again on the floor. Your right leg, your right knee is off the floor. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and back. Okay, get into a push up position again and try, be on your toes and try to touch your heels to the ground. Let's go. Try to touch your knees to the ground. Your hands are steady. Three, two, one. And now slowly walk back with your hands, small steps with your hands towards your legs. And stay down, touching your toes. Don't stand up. It's okay to bend your knees. Stay down. Deep breaths out. Now you have to slowly start coming up and your head comes up right at the end. Slowly come back up. Your head comes up right at the end. Nice one. Let's do an upper body stretch. Your right hand across your body. Pull with your left hand towards you. And pull and look over your right shoulder. Breathe out and switch. Left hand across your body and pull. Towards you, look over your left shoulder. And everyone, if you can send me a selfie post workout, you can post it on the F Fitness page and just tag me and Fatima. It's fine. Okay. Right hand all the way up, bend from your elbow, and then pull with your other hand. Nice start to a Monday. Okay, change. Left hand up, bend from your elbow, and pull. Workout's done for the day. And you're set and energized for the rest of the day. Okay, right hand up, fingers pointed up. Stretch your forearm and your wrist and pull. Okay, same hand pointed down, fingers down and pull and stretch. Okay, change your hand, left hand, fingers pointed up and pull. Okay, again, same hand pointed down and pull. Okay, guys, and we are done. So shake your hands, shake your legs, and shake your entire body, and we are done for today. Thank you, everyone. Thank you. Uh, everyone, the next one is tomorrow evening for a yoga, Hatha yoga session from Kushbu, 6.30 p.m. So try to make it. Every alternate day is a uh, hit session. We're just going to monitor this, uh, how many people can make it in the mornings for a hit session. Um, or So the second week, then we can do accordingly. We might stick to the same timetable or we'll do the alternate, which is evening hit and morning yoga and Pilates. Okay, guys. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Um, on average, we've burned around 500 calories. Uh, any wow. comments? Any feedback?
uh, let me know. Otherwise, uh, have a good day, everyone. Good. Thank you. Bye. Right. Bye bye.